how to understand the muscle function by only looking at the muscle come on let's understand this forget about the origin insertion of the muscle keep in mind every muscle have two attachment either proximal to distal or medial to lateral and try to understand this example with the use of pulley system to take the water from the well the bucket of water move downward to upward it won't move sideward or forward or backward and during tug of war two teams pulls each other the teams will move forward to backward they won't move sideward and downward and upward in the same way muscle also going to work movement happened in the direction of pull so keep in mind next time when you look at this muscle note down the direction of the muscle fibers attachment because which direction is that muscle fiber attaching the same way movement going to happen muscle fibers not a muscle because each muscle have a tons of muscle fibers depends upon the orientation of the muscle fibers group each muscle fibers group produce different movements let's understand more clearly this is pectoralis major muscle look at the fiber orientation of this muscle there are three fiber orientation we can see here the proximal fibers are aligned in a oblique orientation middle fibers are aligned in a horizontal orientation lower fibers are aligned in a proximal lower fibers in a vertical somewhat vertical manner and uh, distal portion of the lower fibers in a horizontal somewhat horizontal manner so if proximal fibers pulls humerus it create the movement of flexion humerus move forward so it produce the movement of flexion of the shoulder joint if middle fibers run in a horizontal manner it pulls the humerus it creates the adduction of the shoulder joint and also medial rotation of the humerus or shoulder joint if lower fibers are contract upper part of the lower fibers running somewhat vertical in manner if humerus in upward position in this pectoralis major lower part of the upper fibers contract it pull produce the movement of extension of the shoulder joint and horizontal fibers of the lower fibers can helps to produce the movement of pulls the humerus towards the body so it create the adduction of the shoulder joint this is how we we will understand the function of the muscle by only looking at another example this is rectus abdominis muscle look at this fibers orientation in a purely vertical manner right so if muscle pull happen or muscle contract it helps to move the trunk forward create the movement of trunk flexion and also one more thing we need to understand look at the most lateral fibers attachment it creating somewhat slight momentum so if more lateral fibers of the rectus abdominis contract it create the movement of lateral flexion also this is infraspinatus the muscle fibers oriented towards more horizontal manner if muscle pull happen if muscle or contract it create the movement of external rotation of the shoulder joint hope you like this video please do like and share this video if you want more content like this don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching